Hello, and welcome to Tales of Vesteria. Yo, Rose, what the fuck are you doing? What's wrong? Why are you all here? That's what we, we want to Yeah, we Where wanted we to going? find out what the fuck you're doing. Oh, well, just taking a walk. Thought maybe I ate too much. Uh, sure. You don't like, I believe that. Every whim that pops into your head, damn it. We thought you might have ditched us to go assassinate someone. Not yet, silly. That comes later. <laughs> Very open about it, at least. It's from someone who lost their son in the war that just broke out. Kill the one who started the battle. The invasion was proposed to the Emperor about a year ago, in documents bearing the name of Pope Mesedra. Huh? You're gonna kill the Pope? Hold on. How do you know someone didn't just use his name? I thought he went missing after all. He went missing maybe. after the... But then again, maybe not. Because I thought that he went missing a year ago, which is after he went off through Paris. Yeah. we will have to investigate further. And what if we find out that he's bad? If it's evil, the scattered bones slay it. Even if it's the Pope? The Pope, evil is the evil. Emperor, even the Shepherd. We you tried to. Oh, was that inappropriate? <laughs> I'm not a fan of that last part, it's true. It isn't like we walk around all stabby-stabby. We make sure what kind of person our target is first. Hmm. I think I understand you better, Rose. Do you now? Well, that's good. I'm starting to understand, too. Why she bears no malevolence, that is. Because she's as nuts as he is? Rose would certainly never tell a lie, that's for sure. She was always that way. It's in her blood. I suppose the Seraphim have, like, some special power. Would just up and start a war? That means that nobody else can hear them. Even the people that can the hear them can't hear them. He's the de facto leader of a powerful country. He's probably got more layers than you'd think. It's a really big fucking door. I hope Tron's not behind it. easier than we thought. This looks like an auditorium of sorts for the believers. Sure looks like a small crowd. Is there anything here before I start that? 25 points. I have two people gathering these fusion points at the moment, which is why it's going up so quickly. And they stack on top of each other. Like, they share the amount. Hello! Minister, Pope, whatever you, you are. Tell me the names of the seraphim who hold the utmost power, known as the five lords. Uno, Lila. Uh, uh... Musus, Oak, and Eumacia. Hyanawa and Amina. Correct. Now, can you tell me the name of the last one, the seraph who's worshipped here at the Shrine Church? Montellus. <gasps> Oh, that was another name she wanted to That's hear. That's right. Mao Tellus is the seraph who has given the entire Glenwood continent his blessing. The seraph worshipped at the shrine church is Mao Tellus? The five lords, huh? Big movers and shakers. I bet Mao Tellus would know something about how to stand against the Lord of Calamity. He's got to. Ah, uh, he is the Lord of Calamity. Is he really all that? Well, he's the leader of the five lords, after all. You must Ooh. be Soray. Brandon Flicker. Welcome to the Rollins Church headquarters. I heard you were to visit. Please, come on in. We are in. Unless there's a secondary in. Hey, kids. You have nothing to say. It's more magnificent than I'd even imagined. The architecture definitely dates it to the height of the era of Asgard. Glad to see you're impressed. But don't let your guard Huge be. false ceilings. I prepared the bottles. Holy bottle? What did a holy bottle do? It once used no weak foe will encounter you until next at the end. Ah, that's actually kinda of useful. Alright, so I'm gonna save. <clears throat> no, I'm not gonna save. <laughs> I was gonna save, but apparently not. This inscription concerns the trial of the shepherd. 
and the spiritual powers he obtains upon clearing it. Could his spiritual powers be real? Bzz, 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 bzz. Be real, real bees. Oh, bees everywhere. <laughs> Just possibly. <laughs> It's all gibberish. It must be some kind of code. <laughs> he said fun when they were Doesn't making it be random for the sake of random. Hey, what does the big rock thing say? I'm afraid I'm not really sure. The inscription is written in some sort of cipher, and the key to interpreting it is handed down only from Pope to Pope. So I guess we'll have to get the Pope to read it then, huh? That kind of stuff, because that could be changed by anyone at any time. Yep. Saw that happening. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. You sound bad was gonna happen. Feel so good. What is going on? I wanna go to say it's a point. domain. Oh god. Just like when we fought Heldon. I love how he turned to stone as well. Oh everyone's turned They're to alive, stone. But it's like They've been turned to stone. Oh, that's creepy. Oh, who are you? Let's walk up to her. Oh, you're the cardinal. Going home already, Shepherd? Huh? I am Cardinal Fortin of the Church of Rollins. Nice entrance. This domain. Is it yours? Ah, huh, so you can still move. <laughs> Fucking clearly. Why don't you lend me your powers? For the sake of the people, of course. Nope. They asked me the same thing in Highland. I hardly think myself the equal of a Philistine like Bartlow. Sounds like something a Philistine would say. Charming. But sticks and stones and so on, young lady. Ooh, she's good. I have but one wish. To see my empire overcome this tumultuous era of chaos. A task only possible if the people are united. But Rollins is far too expansive to unify the people through mere patriotism alone. Shepard, do you know exactly what it is that the state has used for eons to keep an entire country in line? Religion, fear, money. Is it faith? Yes. Yeah. Faith. Religion. It is the belief in their own salvation that inspires in people the greatest sense of unity when they band together against outsiders who share different values. Meaning that my church itself should serve as the cornerstone for all of Roland's. Maybe in your mind. It is but the vision of one who would guide the people. With the name and power of the shepherd, more people than ever can be brought to salvation. Then you should cooperate with the knights. Wouldn't that really be what's best for everyone? I would welcome their efforts if they would simply bend to my will and do as I command. Even if they are a pack of loutish meatheads who can't figure out that their Pope abandoned them. Wait a minute, the Pope just ran away? You didn't have him locked up? I am not a street thug, child. The Pope, Macedra, I should say, left of his own accord. I don't believe that. I believe he... Abandoning his duty to both the Empire and his followers. I get the feeling you somehow convinced him. What, pray tell, would you call such a man? Pretty irresponsible, if what you're saying is true. Irresponsible is one word, and still there are so many fools out there who trust in such a coward. The Knights, for example. In order to bring the people together, we must find Macedra and give him his due punishment. Punishment? Yes, the same punishment that befell those uncivil enough to mistrust me. Then we have a problem. 
We need the Pope to tell us the meaning of the inscription. Why? Cooperate with me and it won't be necessary. Can you read it? The third. need to know. No matter what. Ah, I see. That's very unfortunate. So then you mean to say... What the... My body! That you reject my vision! Don't reject your vision, I just want to know what the fuck is happening. Oh, hello. Let's go. We're leaving. How the fuck did they get here? I mean, they were always here, but how the fuck did they get back yet? And since when could we teleport? That was useless. What? Wait, did they teleport or just go invisible? They broke through my domain and connected with the Seraphim, if only just for a moment. Oh, will I relish this. I'm gonna assume they didn't teleport? I mean, I don't we have fast travel. Ah, here we go. Spectral cloak. Press left to splash quickly and walk around invisible. You can see past obstacles to use a sight to take movement and move undertake to pass enemies with sense of sight. By touching an enemy weak against the water, he can begin a battle with an advantage. We disappeared? Ooh. What the hell was that? That's cool. It's called the spectral cloak. <laughs> You've been practicing in secret, haven't you? That was sweet. Oh. We move We're really slow. We sure. Ah, no, we can't do both. To the Knight's Tower. I'm gonna I guess that there will be enemies around here. Like Hellion enemies, Knight enemies, I don't know. Just enemies in general. Dude. Got a dash. You go on ahead. Oh, uh, is that okay. dude again. Oh hey! This means that killing the Pope may not actually be a bad idea. The Pope fled of his own volition? Apparently. That's what the uh, lady I'm said. Sorry I couldn't get more details. We were sort of running for our lives. No, that is more than enough. I'm just relieved that you weren't captured. Now we've got to find Boris still. Thanks for saving us back there. It's the least I could do. Seraph Miklio, my humble admiration for your bravery. It's nothing really. Wait. It is nothing. All you did was blind her temporarily. We have to do something about her domain. Don't worry. Those I'll have to ask out. how he knew who Let's he was, but I assumed somewhere off screen he introduced everyone. That'll be tough if we don't know where he is. The knights have been hunting him for a year now with no success. Yeah, but they were assuming the whole time that the cardinal was behind the disappearance. Guess what? I think I know where Popadope might be. How? Did you? The village of Gadadin on the southern part of the continent. We won't know for sure until we check it out, of course. How did you get that information? Well, let's just call it an industry secret. You know how it is. Of course. I should have expected no less from the wife of the shepherd. Let us send a search team to Gadana. <laughs> Hold on a minute. The Cardinal already expects that our side will be searching for the Pope. A highly visible squadron of knights would essentially be a bright pink arrow pointed straight at him. Does she know where the Pope is? Other than, like, or why she numbers. wants the Pope other than just to punish him? But that's far too much to ask. We were heading there anyway, weren't we? Chill, Captain, we got this. What is it they say? Pope springs eternal? Abandon Pope! All ye who... Uh, don't go to Gadadin. Okay, settle down. The fuck? My thanks, gentle shepherd. <laughs> Actually, as for what you can do in return, do you suppose we could get a pass to Rollins? I might be mistaken for an ally of the Highland Army otherwise. I have seen for myself the quality of your character. I shall prepare it immediately. Cheers, dude. Thank you. That's a load off my mind. There is something I would like to impart to you as well. Would you please step outside for a moment? I want his armor. It would be so cool to see Saray running around with that um, giant shoulder piece. I'm trying to remember the name of it. I can't. 
Do you remember the art I used when we fought against one another? Which one? You used like four. That is the lion now. Lion now. An art passed down to our band of knights. I and my younger brother Boris are the only ones alive who know it. But now I pass it to you as well. Wilt thou accept? Sure. Yes. See, see, sit iron element. That uh, art trade, art trade, art trade. You get rid of shatter shock. The lion how? Seals a few of the lion one palm and unleashes the blast enemy away. Hidden archery of heavenly torrent. Awesome. So I can do this. There we go. That is actually kind of useful. You're a fast learner. I already knew half of it. I must apologize that this feeble art is all an oaf like me may offer you. I don't know how much use I'll get out of it, but hey. Don't say that. It's incredible. Thank you so much, Captain Sergei. So I don't know if it's a physical Your attack, which is equals. what I you may call use. Me Sergei. Yes. Then you may call me Sirey. Sirey, I am loath to believe the Pope just abandoned his post on us. But I also sense that there may be another side to this unfortunate story. I understand. We'll find the Pope and come back with the truth. Godspeed. Gee, more cutscene? Rose, was it the scattered bones who found the information on the Pope? Maybe. Seeing where the church's money was going gave us a little hint. That's what I thought. You guys sure don't operate in the same way that the knights do. Of course not. An assassin's guild can't function without proper intel. Does that mean the Pope was the still getting money right. that entire time? <laughs> Nobody noticed. Here is your pass, Saray. This is a B minus. It's not a pass. I wish it were so, but we've received word that Byroclef Ridge, which leads to Gadotten, has been blocked by Rosalind. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> we could have been on the ridge right now. If only we'd been a little bolder. Rose! My punchline! <laughs> What's the plan? <laughs> Game hurts. You'll have to go through Cambria Caverns, south of the Meadow of Triumph. Do we have to go there anyway? Underground passage, huh? No problem. No, we don't. That's we have to go thing, isn't it? close you to that. It is. Travel path. You. For like. Okay, so yes, we have to go through the camera caverns anyway. To find the um thing. That guy. The seraphim from Listendale. See I kinda wanna go back to the church and find out if I can activate that save point or if I'll just be trapped in another thing. But let's find out how long this takes to disappear real quick. Uh, about 10 seconds or so, so we can walk about that far. That's cool. Okay. Sweet, so with that one, um, we'll say goodbye. I hope you have a nice morning, a nice evening, a nice afternoon. And in the next one, we're going to go back to actually doing something, rather than just watching other people do something. Ta-ra, everyone.